For round six of the 2015 World Superbike season, we're at Donington Park in the East Midlands of England. Donington opened as a race circuit in 1931. In fact, the first permanent race track in the country. Track activity ceased for the Second World War and the circuit as we now know it opened in 1971 following the purchase of Donington Park by Tom Wheatcroft. The corners are some of the most historic in the world, better known by their names as opposed to their numbers. Not least Redgate here, the very first one at the start of the lap. So we just compare a few of the riding styles into that crucial first corner. So what of the Pirelli tyres? The wear from cold tearing tends to decrease a lot with high temperatures. On the other hand, in such conditions, the track usually offers very little grip. The races can often be held in the rain in England, which makes the asphalt slick and slippery and that increases the rider's efforts, but at the same time highlights their wet riding skills. The first part of the track requires a great stability on the front and the front tyre must be able to maintain its shape to provide the necessary support on those downhill corners. The rear is particularly interesting in the phases of abrupt and violent acceleration, not least coming out of the blind coppice corner before the back straight. If it's particularly cold or the tyre is yet to reach its optimal operating temperature, this really can cause tearing and superficial lacerations to that rear tyre. 